Are you ready to finally get into this bottle of Eclat de Arpage by Lan Vaughn? Cool bottle. Oh, wait, we're gonna announce a giveaway for this Escada Magnetism as well. Keep watching. Again? Again! <laughs> Keep watching. Welcome back to Bougie Fragrance. I'm Dawn, photography guy. What's up? <laughs> He's there like he is each and every All time we time. upload and record a new video. I'm so excited because there's so much to talk about, as always. As always. We always have so much to talk about. Let's start with fragrance of the day. Okay, let's what do it. What are you wearing, photography I am guy? wearing a uh, Womo Signature. By Salvatore yes. Ferragamo. You can never say the name I or you never just say, yeah, never I say really the have name. trouble with that name. Salvatore Ferragamo, try it. Salvatore Ferragamo. <laughs> what was the struggle? <laughs> it's a struggle. Can I? Yeah, yeah, go right ahead. Oh gosh. I love it when he wears this. You actually have three fr favorite fragrances. Yes. What are those? Yes, uh, that one that you're using. Signature by yeah, that, Momo Signature. Uh, Black Orchid, Tom Ford. Tom Ford. And uh, Alien. By? Moogler. Moogler. Some people say Moogler, ooh. Moogler. Some people, oh. Yeah, it's real this nice. Smells like, this smells like photography guy. Yes. Oh gosh, I love that. Mm, that's really good. And I'm wearing the Ever loving Samsara by Guerlain. Oh. I love this fragrance. I've been dipping a little. Look, you I've have been, been dipping. Look, yes, I've been dipping. I just really, really love the smell. I wear it to work, and everybody's like, "Oh, what is that?" And I tell them, and it's usually this because this is what I'm can't get out of my hands lately. Gosh, it's so good. If you haven't smelled this, watch a review because I did a review on this, and it is good, good. This is good, 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 good. So. That out of the way, should we give away the Sascata yes, Magnetism for the Yes, let's give that what? away for the, I fourth think the fourth time. time. Yes, I believe the fourth time. Fourth time. So I'm not gonna go over the notes. I'll show you the bottle one more time. Now, if no one answers this one, I'm gonna put it on the street corner and they so whoever picks it up can, can have put it. put free? Yeah, free, whoever picks <laughs> it up Just free, have somebody it. take this bottle. Yeah. It is a gorgeous bottle. It is a very lovely smell. It really does smell good. Actually, if nobody, wins this i'll send it home with with my daughter oh there you go because she's coming she's gonna be in some videos coming up so that'll be fun too more to talk about of course <sighs> okay so we're giving this away let's yes, get in the box away. photography guy i'm just gonna draw a name to make All it right. fair since i have the cameras right yes. here so let me close the box hopefully somebody that entered this this time actually watches this video yes so they can let us know they won we've given this away three times no, before no wait no wait Okay. The three times we give them that away. Yes. Those same three people entered it again. This one. <laughs> so you have to be. It was you funny. I'm like, look, they won this and they're entering the contest again. Yes. And we did announce it on past videos. So you have to be sure to watch the video to yes. see if you won this fragrance. So yes. hopefully you'll just keep watching. Let's find out who won this again, again. or who won this. Right. I'm gonna shake it up, just make it fair, you know. You know, you really and, should shake that up. And what should I else do? Uh, flip it over. Upside down, because <laughs> I'll spill them all over. So you see in the camera that I can't see anything. I'm just, I guess this is That's the winner. That's it, that's the winner. I guess this is the winner. Let's see who won this. A, B, C. She says deaf I want, oh, A, B, C dot deaf is the name. And she put, I want it with a heart. ABC Def, if you're watching this video, DEF, if you're watching this video, send us an email. The link is in the description. You have to be in the United States. And then in the in the comment, no. The lower 48. In the content, yeah, the lower 48. <laughs> in the comments part of the, um, no, the subject part of your email. Oh, I'm there sorry. You go. There you go. Put, I want it in the comments so that we, in the subject part, so that we don't miss it in our email because we get a whole lot of email every day. Yes. We love email. So if you really need us to pay attention to you, put something in the subject that's going to make it stand out so we actually look at your email. And that is the winner. Congratulations! Yes, congratulations. Hopefully, you got, what, seven days is it? You, it we're gonna, yeah, if you don't get in touch with us in the next seven days, it's going to my daughter. Yes. She will love it. Or he's putting it on the street corner. Either or. One of the two. Either or. <laughs> All of that is out of the way. Are you ready? Yeah, let's do it. Okay, oh my gosh. 
This is a Lambon fragrance, my second. I actually have, I pulled it down even. I have rumor it was suggested to me because it's got magnolia in it. This was suggested to me by one of my subscribers, which also has a YouTube channel. Miss Katie, I've spoke, spoke about her before. Her and I send packages back and forth to each other all the, all the time and she's, she's a doll. Ah, so this says Magnolia in it and she turned me on to it and I purchased it and it's very nice. It's a very nice fragrance. So I'm like, that was a winner. Let's try this one. I'm gonna actually move this one out of the way so we can concentrate and focus on this. Yes. Photography guy. Yes. Are you ready? Yeah. I, I like the container it's in. You know, I think I've gotten inside this, there it goes. Yep. Inside this once before, I wasn't sure how it opens. Just like so. <laughs> and we're gonna get in here. I'm Ooh. so excited. That, oh, the bob, the color is lavender. The fragrance color. There you go. You probably can see it better in the camera mm -hmm. that way. Sure can. There's some, oh, look at these rings. That's kind of different. I like that. What's the cap? Hold on. Oh, look, there's a gemstone. A little purpley lavender gemstone, too. How do I get in? Oh. Like that? You just lift the top <laughs> off. So simple. I, I'm, I'm going to smell it. Well, that would be good. Or should I let you smell it first? Um, can you throw it to me? I'm not going to throw it to you. <laughs> we know from past experiences that I break things. Look at you go, photography guy. And so this is kind of neat. It comes in its own acrylic case. That's kind of cool. I don't know if I'll display it in this. You know, I don't like the case anymore. It's already no, no, frustrated I, yeah, me. The, its case is cool, but... It's already, it's hard to put together. Yeah. I mean, I don't want to put a fragrance on and then have to put it together. You didn't line up my oh, tester. I know, you. yeah, I know. <laughs> I, I, it ran down my arm, that sprayer. Oh, it's kind of went everywhere now. Oh, well, while you're looking at the bottle, let's talk about it's this. not bad. Let's talk about what's in it. Oh, let me put the lid on it for you. Oh. Does it stay? Oh, look at that. It stays on. Oh, that's your okay. thing. So it's got a, is that a cat? I don't know. It's got a woman and a something. Maybe a child. Oh, I don't know if I like it or not yet, photography guy. Uh -oh. It smells lovely. All right, I'm going to go it ahead. It smells good. Yeah, let's talk about it. First of all, this retails for $65. I got it on fragrancenet.com for photography guy. $29. $21.44. for some fragrance. It's not a bad price. So if you want to try a Landmon fragrance, this is not a it's not a bad start. The main accords in this bottle are floral, fresh, green, musky, and fruity. The notes are <laughs> peony, peach blossom, tea leaf. Green Lilac, Amber Musk, Chinese, Osmanthus, Pettigrain, Wisteria, and Cedar. Some people say that this smells to them like Gucci Bloom, which I have not purchased yet, but Gucci Bloom is a really, really big seller. I'm going to tell you that there's 68 fragrances in Land Bond's database, 68 of them. That's pretty good. That's not bad at all, yeah. and I've got two. Yeah. 66 well, to go, photography guy. So this got 3.95 out of five votes and it was released in 1927. Wow. I was looking at my notes, it's like, no. And it looks like this fragrance also is their most successful fragrance to date. Wow. So let me smell it again if that's yeah, the case. That's I mean, if, it, if everybody's loving it. Oh, you know what? Okay, I have something there. I always it's have to bad. find out where I don't have something. No, nope. it's a little light for me. Is it light for yeah, you? Yeah, it's light, you know, but it's not bad. I can still But you smell like it. it. Yeah, yeah. You like the yeah, fragrance. Absolutely. I have to, it's, I have to let it dry down just a little bit. Why it does that, I brought out a couple oils that are in it. It's actually got musk and patchouli. <laughs> let's, let's, let's see what these smell like. So yeah. patchouli to some me. Some of them can be pretty rough. <laughs> some of these can be pretty rough. Oh, 
Oh gosh, I think I like this one better than I like oh, the rumor. Oh. Let's see. All right, the patchouli. The patchouli to me smells honestly like I went to a concert at Woodstock. Oh. Without the marijuana. Oh, see. No, you, you got excited for a moment. <laughs> Yeah, it really smells like hippies. It just smells like old school hippies to me. Ah, it's good, it's good. I wouldn't wear it by itself. I definitely wouldn't wear it by itself, but it smells good to me and everybody's nose is different. It might, patchouli might give you a whole different concept of what patchouli is. But to me, it smells like an old school hippie. And then we're gonna look at musk. There's musk in this too. So musk to me smells like, oh, let's see. It smells like guinea pig pee. What? <laughs> guinea pig pee. I had a guinea pig way back in the day yeah, when I first smelled so this. I. It kind of reminded me of guinea pig pee. So yeah. I definitely, yeah. I definitely yeah. wouldn't wear this on its own. No. Can you believe that guinea pig pee? Yeah, no, that's bad. Uh, with a little sweeter side. Oh, there's a sweeter side to guinea pig pee. Well, there is in this bottle. Okay. <laughs> there is. You're funny. There is in this bottle. Oh, the more I smell it, the more I like it. I don't uh, imagine smelling and liking guinea pig pee, but they're, yeah. like I said, the sweeter side of it. Yeah, we're not going to go get a guinea pig or anything. I don't want a guinea pig because I don't really <laughs> want right, guinea pig pee. Very good. It also has a perfumey, the, the more I smell it, it's a perfumery kind of sweet, guinea urine pig <laughs> guinea pig pee. Yes, it's not bad. I wouldn't wear it alone. I don't want to smell like sweet guinea pig pee. Right. So I wouldn't wear it alone, but it's not bad. So it's it's nice to have these all these oils available so that I can. It this does not smell like guinea pig pee. <laughs> it really doesn't. It doesn't. I do not smell the musk in the bottle. Oh, maybe I do. Uh -oh. I actually do. Uh oh. But it's sweetened up by the other fragrances uh, that are in there, the I other see. notes that are in there. I see. It sweetens yes. up. Okay. I like it. Very good. What do you think, photographic guy? Uh, I don't, yeah, it's not bad. You really. like it too? Yeah. Look at the little stone in the top. Look That's at cool. that. It is so cool. And the rings are kind of cool too. I wonder if they signify something specific. Hmm. If any of you know, just put it in the descriptions. And while you're doing that, don't forget to put in the description of what your fragrance of the day is. Yes. I really like this. It's not something I would reach for right now this season. Definitely, maybe if you're a spring summer kind yeah, of. Yeah, it does absolutely. It yeah, reminds it's me of not the deep, summer. warm, yeah. spicy, sweet that I reach for in the winter. But it's good, even though some days. I mean, I work in an air-conditioned office every day, so I sometimes I wear. I'm, I'll go to work with any Juicy Couture fragrance on. That's not. That's a springy, summery thing. It's really my mood. But for the most part, I really think if you are a seasonal fragrance wearer, save this for spring. Spring and summer for sure. All right, there you go. It smells good. All right, photography guy, do you want to talk about what's going on in our lives? In our lives? In our lives. In our lives. Are you talking about the live shows? I am talking about the live shows. What are, what are some of the things? Yes. Yeah, there you go. Good job. Why do I always? It's okay. Okay, all right. So our live shows, we're going to start these next weekend. I don't know if we're going to do them on Friday or Saturday. Probably shooting for Saturday. Yeah, we're shooting for Saturday. We're shooting for Cause, Saturday. Because we both work on Friday. So the idea that we came up with, and we're so super stoked, excited about, because we live, like we say all the time, we're in the southwest part of Florida. So we live along the Gulf Coast, and we're so close to the water. And everywhere we go, there's docks and piers and, and restaurants to dine in that are on the Gulf Coast or on inlets or bays. So what are we doing, Photography Guy? We are going to go uh, every Saturday and find a dock or an inlet uh, or bay that we can do a live show and talk about fragrances. Talk about, actually we're gonna call the series Doc Sides Forgotten Fragrances. Yes. Doc Side Forgotten Fragrances, something along that line. And we're gonna pull one fragrance off the shelf that I just don't touch and I don't reach for. I'm gonna talk about 
it again. We're gonna review it again and talk about why I'm not reaching for it as much anymore. So that'll be so much fun, but there's so much ideas. We've got their power plant just north of us that has a manatee viewing center when it's cold. So we're gonna take you there so you guys can see the live manatees in their natural habitat. Right, where they stay warm. We also live very close to Boca Grande's lighthouse. It's huge, we can get in it. We're hopefully gonna take you inside if they let us. We're gonna try until they tell us we can't. But we're gonna take you to the Boca Grande lighthouse and we'll do a review there. There's hundreds, and I mean hundreds, of docks here in Florida, very close to us that we can show you. We'll talk about the history and the dock or whatever information we can get about our certain location. And sometimes when it rains, we might have to shoot between the rain on our dock in the backyard. And so yes. we'll show, cause we live on a beautiful canal. It's fresh water. You might see gators and a lot of birds and wood storks. We have a lot of and, gators out there. Yep, and blue herons, things like that. So we're so super excited about that as well. So look forward to our live videos cause we certainly, certainly are photography guy. Yes. I think that's it. I think it is. All right, on that note, Never leave your house naked. Always rock your day with a fragrance. Don't forget to hit subscribe, click that thumbs up, hit that bell to be notified of each and every time we upload a new video. And if that bell has got a line through it, unsubscribe to our channel, resubscribe, hit that bell again and it's gonna work like a charm for you. That's it. All we'll right. see you on our live. Live. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Keep watching from our giveaways as well. Photographic guy, show yes. some love. Bye. Bye.